And now we can do useful things with those concepts that can help you solve your math problem. Let's say that I have a right triangle where A equals X, B equals Y, and C equals R. Let's say that I know my angle theta, and I know B, and I need to find out what A and C are. I know that sine theta equals B over C. Then on the left side, I can multiply sine theta by C and divide the entire product by sine theta. From the algebra exercise, you know that you have to do the same thing on the other side of the equal sign. Then, on the left side, the sine thetas cancel out. On the right side, the c's cancel out. And you will be left with c equals b over sine theta. Then you can write tangent theta equals b over a. Using algebra, you will have a equals b over tangent theta. Or, since you have already found c, you can also write cosine theta equals a over c. Again, using algebra, you will have a equals c times cosine theta. Remember, the values of the ratios for sine theta, cosine theta, and tangent theta, which are y over r, x over r, and y over x respectively are given to you by a calculator since they are unique ratios for every theta from 0 to 90 degrees they have already been pre-calculated a long time ago